Do you have the dreaded access is denied error when plugging in your external hard drive into your computer? F drive is not accessible. Access is denied. In this quick how-to video, I'm going to show you how to fix it. Plug in your hard drive and take note of your hard drive letter because you will need that later. First, you want to go down to your taskbar and then click or type into your search bar. You want to type this PC and look for the this PC best match. Left click. Now you just want to identify which hard drive is not being read or is inaccessible. For me, that's my F drive. For you, it might be a different one. You want to left click and then right click on it and go to properties. Inside of the properties, you want to go to the security tab. So left click on the security tab and then you want to come down and click on the advanced button. You can see that the owner unable to display the current owner. You want to click change. Okay, and then you want to put in the name of your machine and check names. The name of my computer was found. If you don't know the name of your computer, you can come down to the taskbar again and type in system and open up the system information, left click. You can expand the items and then look for system manufacturer. So mine is Asus. This will be whatever name you entered in your system as the login name for Windows. So once you have that, you can close and then go back and enter it into the select user or group. Once you have this filled out, you can press OK. You also want to place a checkbox and replace owner on the subcontainers and objects. And you also want to place a checkbox and replace all child object permission entries with inheritable permission entries from this object. All right, so we entered the checkbox here and then one up here. All right, so we have set the owner. Now we need to add them. You'll click add and then where it says principal, select the principal, left click on it. Okay, and again, type in your Windows username and click check names. The name was found. Click OK. Okay, and make sure this folder and subfolders and files are, are selected from the drop down and select full control. Just click OK. And click apply. Okay, and you just want to click yes to replace all security permissions. Okay, and Click yes again on this window. Okay, click yes again on this window. Okay, and click okay again. And click apply. And then click okay. Now you can see the capacity of the hard drive and the amount of free space on your hard drive. And if you click into it, you should now be able to see your files again.